Hey there guys, all things Apple Plus here, and I wanted to give you guys a quick tutorial on Final Fantasy Record Keeper and something that you guys might enjoy while playing the game. Now this isn't really so much of a hack, but it is a way to speed up your progress within the game. Um, within the game. So let's go ahead and launch Final Fantasy Record Keeper and just to show you guys what it's all about. So if you've never played Final Fantasy Record Keeper, it's or any of the Final Fantasy games, I suggest you at least pick up one of the games. Uh, let me go and turn this down a little bit. Uh, the stories and the uh, the challenges and the quests within these games, these RPG games, are just amazing. And there's just great characters that you can meet all throughout. There's great cinematics. Um, there's just so much to talk about within the game. There's uh, legend and lore within the game. So if you ever get a chance to play this game, this game in particular, it compiles... Uh, Final Fantasies 1 through 14 through tactics and I believe we should be getting 15 pretty soon within the Japanese version But this is kind of it. It's it's really it's a pretty fun game uh, You go into battle through different dungeons and you fight your enemies and um, You fight bosses from uh, you know from the games and from the uh, games pasts so and then every you know every so often every week they release new characters and um opportunities for you to get new items through relic draws so the more the better items that you have the better that your characters can be and they can pull off um like special moves so to speak so that's kind of the game but for some people that know the game and that have played the game the game can lag quite a bit and uh, i wouldn't say lag but just the the speed of the game when you have you know top-notch characters or top characters that you know can breeze through levels and that can just muscle their way through each level it can kind of get a little bit um, it can kind of feel kind of slow so I found a tweak if you ever heard of X mod games this is only available if you are jailbroken um, you can download this application via Cydia and it will speed up the process within your game so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to quit the actual game and I'm gonna load up Xmod and I'm gonna show you what it does and how to get it so this is the main hub for Xmod you can actually create an account if you would like to they have tons of games that you can hack like Clash of Clans, Pokemon Go, uh, Final Fantasy Record Keeper or if there's other games that you um, that you have installed that aren't listed here you can always click at the very bottom of the page and in, and uh, you can add your applications uh, so they can be uh, quote unquote hacked or tweaked. So I'm gonna go ahead and launch the American version of Final Fantasy Record Keeper. And if you notice, there's a little kind of robot sticking its head out the the right side of my phone. That's kind of the um, your <laughs> kind of the navigator guy who will allow you to go ahead and perform any sort of hacks and tweaks. Now there isn't anything so crazy as, you know, free mithril or free money or anything like that, but this will allow you to speed up the progress within a game. So actually, um, I'm in the midst of a battle here, but let me go ahead and show you what I mean with this battle. So, right away, you're given, especially when you pause the game, you're given a chance to either use a slow option or a fast option. And slow meaning the, the wait time for your character to react or to um, select a move is a lot slower and versus fast being, you know, your characters are, you know, blazing through some levels. But let me show you what happens when you bump it up just a little bit. So we're going to take auto off. And I'm actually going to tap on the navigator guy and it will allow me to use an accelerator. And this accelerator, when you tap on it, multiplies the time of the actual game and it makes the game run a ton faster. So we're going to bump this up to, let's give you guys 50%. So we're going to tap out and the navigation bar will go away. And then we're going to go and hit resume. And if you notice the animations, or if you've played the game before, the animations are going super, super fast.
So, as you can see, my characters are just completely wigging out right now. And there you have it. There's your boss completed. And it just, it's a awesome way just to speed through levels. And just a great way, if you are first starting the game, just a real fast way on just breezing through some of these levels because it's just sometimes some of these levels just they take a long time I'm actually turn down the volume just a little bit more so Xmod how do you get this onto your device and how do you even get the accelerator working so let me go ahead and show you how to do that back out let's go ahead and go to Cydia and then from Cydia we're gonna go under search and from search we're gonna t or actually before we even go into search, I'm going to have a source that you guys are going to install. Excuse me. And that is Xmod Game. So you're going to go to this source right here. I'm going to have you guys up or install that source. If you don't know how to, go ahead and hit edit and add. And I already have this source already listed right here. I'm going to go ahead and put that up on um, under the... Under the uh, under my phone so you guys can actually see it so it will be in the description and it will also be within the uh, the video as well so it's gonna be app.xmodgames.com after you do that go and hit search and go ahead and type in xmod and it's the very first one It's xmod games go ahead and tap on that and in yours will say install mine and says modify for the moment so once you do go ahead and hit install and it should respring or at least navigate you back to Cydia after you do that, you should have this application, this icon right here. Once you do, you can go ahead and tap on it and you can uh, create an account through Xmod. And then through, uh, if you want to, again, if you want to load in a game of yours like Final Fantasy Record Keeper, it probably won't show up on their main page. You will have to add it. All you have to do is click the plus button and select what application that you would like to add. And that's that's it for loading that. Now, they're under the more section, you can actually um, toggle on the accelerator. And the accelerator is what allows you to make the games go a lot faster. So that's pretty much Xmod in, in a nutshell. Uh, there are a ton of games that you can use with Xmod that, um, like Clash of Clans, you can, um, I believe with Xmod, you can search for specific towns um, and clans that have um, a certain amount of gold or, um, you know, that have a certain, you know, townhouse level. Uh, there's there's just tons and tons of tweaks. So check out to see which, um, you know, tweaks that your game may have on there. So let's, let me check Pokemon Go. Um, It looks like for this one, I'm not entirely sure what it does. But for the most part, most games will have more than just a couple of features or just an introduction. They'll have a long list of tweaks that you can install. So that's Xmod. I hope you guys did enjoy this, tuto this tutorial. If you guys did, go ahead and please share this, like this up. Go ahead and if you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section below. And for all things Apple Plus, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day and night. Peace.